guys, welcome back to my channel, Danielle here. And I know we're straight a little bit away from our usual thrift content, but I posted on my Instagram whether a Princess Polly try on haul would be something that y'all are interested in, and majority said, yeah, I'm down to watch. Feel free to follow me on my Instagram, I am at Girl here, if you ever want to influence the type of content that I put on my channel. But let's talk about Princess Polly, because they're pretty much an Australian brand. You guys, they have tons of clothes as far as tops, jackets, skirts, jeans, and even shoes that are all based off the latest trends, street style, pop culture, and you'll notice as we're going through the website that they're like totally Instagram worthy outfits. I ended up getting a few Princess Polly items. I'm actually wearing a full Princess Polly fit right now, but we'll get into those details later. They came through with a discount code for you guys. So if you use the code DANIELLER20 at checkout, you guys will get 20% off your order. But if you end up liking any of the pieces throughout the video, I'll leave everything linked down below along with their website. A few other things to note is that they do ship within the US. So they offer free express shipping to any US orders over $50, which is about three to four days. Not only that, they also have afterpay so you can pay with installments. But with that said, let's get to this video. Okay guys, let's get started with some tops and I'll just begin with the one that I'm wearing now. This is El Basico Corrupt Tea and let me tell you, usually I am incredibly skeptical when purchasing anything online just because I'm the type of person who has to feel the fabric, want to know the quality of a true piece before I even spend money on it. And oh my gosh you guys, this tea is super structured, very good quality, it's pretty thick too. I love little pieces like this because you can wear them alone like I am now or they make the perfect layering pieces with dresses or little Amazons over it. But pretty much this tee just has a classic crew neck with little, I want to say these are short sleeves, but more borderline cap sleeves because they are a little cropped. The crop length is pretty nice. It's like right above my belly button and then it is just rib knit construction. So super clean, super sleek. Oh, I love it. This next piece is one of my favorites. I am finally jumping onto the tie-dye bandwagon. Am I a little late? Maybe just a little, but when you guys see this, you'll understand why I'm absolutely obsessed with it. But this is the Penny Lane Tee. You guys, look at this. It's a pink tie dye. It has a bold lettuce edge trim, which I absolutely love. And then just the cut of this is very flattering because it does have more of a wider neck. And it is super stretchy. So even on those days where we're feeling super bloated or have a food baby going on, it just fits very nicely. The next piece is called the Jaden Top. When I saw it on the site, I was like, Oh my gosh, it is so cute. Add to cart, I need it absolutely. And it is this cute little cardigan right here. Yes, I think it's super pretty. It also comes in multiple colors, but fair warning, the rest of my haul has tones of pastel blue and green. I was just like the most attracted to those colors. But you guys, look at this top as a cute little crew neck, a button front closure, and this one does have more of elbow length sleeves and a very structured rib knit construction. But again, like the white tee, this is a piece that you could either wear alone with like baggy jeans and some Nikes, or it makes a really cute layering piece. And even if I put it over what I'm wearing now, it'd be so freaking cute. So I always love these very versatile pieces. Ooh, we are moving into some textured pieces. I wish you can feel the Phoebe jumper through the screen right now because it is so freaking soft. Here we have this cardigan here in this very pretty angelic, pastel blue, I absolutely love it. But again, it's just like the classic cut of a regular cardigan with the crew neck, long sleeves, button front. The only cool part is this construction with all the fuzziness. But not only that, you guys, I like tactile pieces just because they actually make it look like you tried to style a piece. Like you can literally wear a tank top and jeans, but if you have some sort of like fuzzy piece, vinyl piece, it has an effortless style. We're moving on to dresses now. I did walk away with two of them, and the first one is called the Alasia dress. And really, it's more of a transitional piece as we're moving into fall, winter. But I had to walk away with it because imagine it with some tights, some boots. Oh, it would look so freaking cute. But it's this dress right here. It's sleeveless and a mini length. What I really like about it is the print because it does have like an all over houndstooth print. And then the bust does have this like very subtle seam detail that kind of gives me a dark academia type vibe. And an element that I absolutely love is that it has adjustable straps. Y'all know that if you have A cup babies, you need all the support you can get from top so adjustable straps totally come through but with the seams on the front it really helps out your figure it 
makes it look like you're super snatched. It's also lined, so it's not sheer whatsoever. You can't see through it, so you're fully protected and won't be showing anything off. This next dress, I had to walk away with it. It's called Afterthought Mini Dress, and I'll spoil it already, but it's pretty much just a slip. I've been thrifting these past few days. I have not come across a slip dress in such a long time, and really, I think they're just super in demand. I feel like silk and satin is definitely a trend for the fall. So when I saw this on the site, I was like, oh yeah, I'm definitely taking this one. And it's this really pretty green slip right here. Again, it is a mini length and it does have a floral print. This dress does have adjustable straps and a squared neck. I love that just because I like showing off a little bit of collarbone. I think it's super sexy. Another really flirty part to this is that it has a little front bend here so you can show a little bit of leg too. Placing it over this crop tee, you guys, tell me this does not look cute. With some tube socks and sneakers, heck yeah, love that. We made it through the dresses, let's get moving into some bottoms. So let's talk about the skirt that I'm wearing actually. It's called the Lona mini skirt. It's pleated, it's plaid, and and it's neutral colors. It doesn't have a zip closure or any button closure, so it's not very restricting, but instead it has a back elasticized waistband, which oh, feels so nice, especially if I'm sitting down for a really long period of time. It's another piece that's super structured, well-made, feels like good quality because the fabric is thick. Let's talk about how I actually walked away with the pair of jeans to fit me perfectly. Anytime I'm buying jeans online, Oof, I always have the worst luck. I'll listen to reviews and the size guide, and when it comes in, it's either super freaking small or two, three sizes too big. And so I was really hesitant to even show a pair of jeans on here. But oh my God, guys, I'm so surprised because these are my new favorite jeans. I was reading their reviews and everyone was saying to size down because they're super oversized, a very relaxed fit. And I'm so glad I listened because these fit like a freaking glove. They have a high waist, a light to medium wash that's even, and a straight leg. But even though it's a straight leg, it is super baggy again. And that style is super in right now. So I love pairing it with cute little crop tops to have something more fitted on the top and loose on the bottom. Do so you guys know that on this channel, we are big lovers of vinyl. So the last jacket I have is the Starboy jacket that is made entirely of vinyl. Look at this, this is just so freaking cool. Such a statement piece too, but it has the same style and cut as a denim jacket, only different construction. So we have the spread collar, the button front closure, we have pockets, all throughout the front here, long sleeves. The color to this is super cool. It definitely is a little bit more muted, but still really bold and fits the color palette of the other items I got. But for sure, this has an oversized fit, so I'll probably want to put something a little bit more tight fitted underneath. But Alright you guys, that pretty much does it for the end of this Princess Polly try on haul. If you liked any of the pieces, let me know in the comments down below. Also, if you want to shop any of the pieces, they're also linked down below in the description. And don't forget, there is a discount code for you guys, 20% off if you use Danielle R20 at checkout. But if you want to keep up with me throughout the week, I do have an Instagram, I am an eggy girl here, and I also have a Depop, I am at Twinelle. Thanks so much for watching. As always, I post videos twice a week. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!